everybody, what's going on? So we are about to head out of here and head over to a hotel because our building is about to be tented for termites. Um, about, not not about, it's tomorrow morning. Um, but they're coming potentially quite early and we have the hotel room for tonight. So we are going to head on out of here. Now, one of the things that has to happen is that Pillow, the parakeet, has to come with us. And so we have to get him into his carrying cage. Cage, case, cage, case. Anyway, we have a little carrier for him, and we've been practicing over the last couple of weeks of, uh, at first he was kind of afraid of it, so we had to put it really close to his cage and put little treats in there and kind of lure him in, because it, not only is it the, the carrier itself, but there's the big plastic lid that goes over top of it. And understandably, he was a little freaked out about it at first, but now he's fine. He goes in it on his own. The tricky part is, I don't know if he's in the mood to go in it right now, but it, you know, at some point, we don't, we're not in a huge rush to get out of here, but we do need to be leaving pretty soon. So we have to try to get him into the cage and take him down to the car. And then we're taking his regular cage as well. We're going to just dump out the food and water so nothing spills and put everything in the car, drive it over to the hotel, and get him re-set up in the hotel. And hopefully he'll be fine. He's a pretty adventurous, kind of spunky little guy, so uh, hopefully he won't have too much of an issue with it. Uh, the alternative is to leave him here while they spray gas into the apartment, which obviously is no alternative at all. So let's see if we can make this happen. Go in and get some millet. Go get millet. Come on, Go in and get your millet. Go get your millet. Go get your millet. Okay, so Pillow is in the container. We actually had to stop shooting because we had to, Kevin and I had to uh, tag team this. Kevin kind of had him on his hand, and then I sort of scooped the cage up underneath him and he's in there now he's perfectly fine and calm we got his cage there we're gonna take where is it here we go we're gonna we're gonna take the whole cage the whole shebang over there and get him set up in the hotel room so let's go we just have to transport him like this because it's safer yeah and yeah the cage with all the toys flying around yeah we got his millet in there so have a snack cheapy while we move everything uh, quick snack Quick snack, yeah. But this is so this is where we're staying. Oh my gosh. It's so cool. Touching the flowers. Yeah. So where we're staying, it's sort of it's it's owned by a Brazilian couple and I guess it's reminiscent of hotels or um, little bed and breakfast in Brazil and it's super cute and the, the reason we're actually here is because they take pets and there were a lot of people in our building have pets so we needed to be booked in a place that allowed animals so that was why we had this particular place rather than just like a holiday inn or something like that. <laughs> Alright, Brendan's doing his ritual jumping on the hotel bed. <laughs> And we just brought Pillow in. Let's see. Hi, Pillow. You ready to go back in your cage? Okay, we've just gotten Pillow's cage set up here, kind of right in the middle of the room. And, oh, he's eating his millet. He might not want to come out, but let's see. Hi, Chief. You want to come out? Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, back up here. Oh, gotta get your tail out. There we go. Oh, we're in a whole new room. Exactly the same. We'll put your food in there, Mommy, give you your look. water. There's all your toys. It's exactly the same. Okay? But be oh, careful sure. when you go that way. You don't want to go face first into that yeah. wall. I can also look like a frog. You are like a frog. Look at you. What oh. a good shovel <laughs> you are. <laughs> So we are here for the next couple of days and hopefully Pillow will just be nice and comfortable here in his cage. So today's Monday, we go back to the apartment on Thursday, but because Pillow cannot be in the apartment for five more days after that because he's so sensitive to the gases that they spray in there, um, we're going to take him, he's going to go back in his carrier, we're going to deliver him to Kevin's friend who's going to babysit him for five days and then we'll pick him up and bring him home. So we're gonna do this whole thing again to take him to Kevin's friend's house, and then once again to take him home. But hopefully he'll be an old hat at it at that point. That's a term, right? Old hat. Sure. <laughs> he'll be an old hat at that point, so hopefully it'll just be nice and smooth, and he's already completely settled in. 
He's nice and calm. Are you tired, Pilly? You've had a long day. This has been very exciting for you, hasn't it? So that's it. We are vlogging this hotel adventure on our other channel, Kevin and Krista, and Hello will be in those videos as well. So if you want to check those videos out, you can subscribe to that channel as well. Please like and subscribe to this channel, Kevin and Krista Extras, and we'll see you next time. Bye. And then let's go all the way.